Well, you've got the chance to solve a hilarious mystery while you feast on a fantastic dinner. The nation's biggest interactive comedy murder mystery dinner theater show is playing in Greenville. We've got Crystal McFarlane here, a player in The Dinner Detective. Welcome. Glad you're here. Thank you for having me. Um, you're one of the actors who will sit among the ticketed guests during this show. Uh, tell us about the character and the role you play. So every show is different. That's the cool thing about it. Um, so one show, I could be playing your table actor. The next one, I can be your murderer. And the next one after that, I can be the host. So every show is different, and that's what makes it really cool. And you're blending in there. People don't realize that you're not just there to socialize. Maybe they put a couple of you players together. Exactly. Or... There's several okay. of us. Um, and so you just never know who it's going to be. And like so it's it. really fun. Well, for people who've never attended this kind of event before, it happens in a hotel banquet room. Um, guests come in. They're enjoying a nice meal. And then... Suddenly what happens? And then all chaos breaks loose. Uh -huh. So we have clues hidden throughout the room, um, and that's the fun part of it, is you just never know what's going to happen. Tons of surprises around every corner. Uh, you may have where someone just comes in screaming, and it just kind of startles you, and that's so much fun. And okay, so everybody there has witnessed this guy come staggering in, and now yes. the clues are being revealed. The culprit in the crime is hiding in plain sight somewhere in the room, they say. And as a guest, you might find yourself to be the prime suspect. Uh, what goes into solving the mystery? How do people work together to, to figure out who done it? Yeah, so we have lots of clues, like I said earlier, and the clues will help you to solve finding out um, who it is, why they did it is one of our biggest things. Okay. You really want to pay attention to names and dates, numbers, all those things to make sure that you can truly figure out the reason behind the crime. This is fun. People love living this in a, in a casual dinner outing. Very fun with yeah. friends and groups. Um, General admission gives you the full murder mystery experience, but then a great, uh, and with gratuities in there, but there's also a package for top sleuth and interrogation reception. What happens during that? Yeah, so during our interrogation reception, you get about 10 minutes in the beginning, and we do have several other, like, breaks throughout the show that you mm -hmm. get up and you're going to talk to people around the room, get to know people because as a table actor at the time, you're going to go and you're going to get to know as many people as you can because mm -hmm. that's our goal is to make you feel included and to make you feel like you had such a great time. Yeah. Um, and we do have a prize package. Our prize package is valued up to $100 and it's not a $100 bill. I'm sorry, but it is valued up to $100. All right. There's, there's, uh, there's fun ways too. I like to imagine that a group of people comes and and you can get a special package called the suspect package. Yes. If you and I are friends, I'd be like, I'm buying the suspect package for her. And then yes. you end up being a big suspect. Correct. And you don't tell me about it. Yeah. It's a surprise. So that's the, that's like the surprise of the night. And so many guests love that. Yeah. Like when the person comes up and you'll bring a picture in, like if you're surprising me, you bring a picture of me and I wouldn't know. And then they would just put the picture out and you'd see it, you'd be like, oh, and they run around. It's, it's so Very much fun. Cool. Yeah. Well, you personally, we're talking, you got into this because you attended an event like this yourself yes. and you had such a good time. You, you just left going, how can I get involved? Right? Exactly. Yes. So we um, are always looking for actors and actresses to join our team. We do have a group of actors in Greenville, um, but we're always looking for more. So we actually have an audition tonight. Um, really? But yeah, so it was so much fun when I went that I was like, all right, I got to do this. <laughs> and you see people there, um, they go for birthdays, anniversaries, graduations. What kind of reactions do you get from people? That it's an intense night. And then at the end, they're like, wow. They always come up and they're like, we had so much fun. And we also offer uh, businesses that come out and do like corporate events or birthday parties, stuff like okay. that. Very and cool. we just don't do private events. So a lot of people ask us questions about that. But an unforgettable experience, however you do it. Uh, yes. There's the Dinner Show Detective show coming up here in Greenville on Saturday. We're going to put that info on screen in just a moment. First, anything else people should understand about how this works or, or what makes the Dinner Detective such a special experience? Yeah, so we do like to involve you guys as much as we can. If you come, we ask that you come dressed up. Make mm -hmm. it a fun night for yourself. Um, you can dress up and just very dressy clothes or even dress up in your spy outfits, yep. whatever you like. Very cool. Um, we are more an adult geared show. Uh, we do have an age limit of 15 years old and older. But overall, you know, biggest thing is to know that we don't just do private events. We do offer other events as well. What an experience. Well, Crystal, we really appreciate you being here and knock them dead on Saturday. Yes. If you yeah. are aren't yeah. that person. <laughs> the Dinner Detective Murder Mystery Dinner plays Saturday, September 16th, inside the Cambria Hotel. That's 135 Carolina Point Parkway. There are shows on the calendar about every two weeks through December 2nd at this point. And uh, tickets are available through the Dinner Detective website. We'll have that information on accesscarolina.com.